All right, we have an update on breaking news. We first brought you on Eyewitness News at 11 o'clock. What a sticky, awful situation, to say the least, for a city work crew trying to fix a pothole when their truck was actually swallowed up, the road simply caving in, sinking in. This all happened this morning at Dumfries and Balmore 4th. Eyewitness News reporter Adela Uchita there live with the story. Adela? Well, our city work crews are still here. First, fixing a broken water main and then patching up the road. But another city work crew got a big surprise this morning when they showed up to patch the street. Oh, my gosh. What started out as a quiet morning in Meyerland ended up with a big, noisy surprise. We heard a loud boom. And we heard the helicopter, so we came out to check it out. That loud boom heard by the neighbors was this. A seven-ton dump truck filled with asphalt halfway down a gaping hole in the street. No one was hurt, but it had caved in because of an underground water main break. Preliminary information is that the water line underneath, which was not detected from the surface, caused the subsoil to dissipate. They're not smiling. Neighbors gathered at the intersection of Dumfries and Balmforth to watch crews first take the asphalt out of the truck, then try and try again to pull the dump truck out of the yawning hole. The neighbors say they'd been complaining about this patch of road since last week. I called 311 to let them know that they were having a problem over here and that they need to come out here and address it. And uh, it's just gotten worse and worse every day. Finally, with the help of heavy machinery, a city of Houston tow truck dragged the dump truck out of the hole. But this was more than just a spectacle for the neighbors. It left some questioning the safety of the roads. Just drove over that this morning, taking my kids to school. Pretty scary. Now, we are told by City Council Member Ann Clutterbuck, who represents this area, that many of Houston streets are slated for major overhaul and rebuilding in the next two decades. But she could not tell us offhand when the Meyerland neighborhood might see those improvements. Live in Southwest Houston, Adele Uchita, 13 Eyewitness News.